Property Tribes is delighted to welcome a new supplier partner. It's Fusion Furniture Solutions and I'm joined by Neil and James. And Neil, uh, guys, great to have you on board Thanks with Property Tribes. Give us a little overview of the business. Uh, well, I set it up uh, about 11 years ago now and uh, we started uh, furnishing investment properties and it, it's gone on from, from there to do... Uh, Landlord properties, HMOs, um, service departments is the latest, obviously latest thing, and we also do sort of show homes and view homes for developers as well. So uh, yeah, busy, busy times. Indeed, and the reason that I became aware of you guys is that whenever somebody was asking for a furniture solution on the social web, landlords were saying fusion, fusion, fusion. Oh, so you you've, yeah. you've obviously <laughs> doing something right. Yeah, we've uh, we've we've come on leaps and bounds in in the last couple of years. Really, uh, you know, getting into the HMO market, it, and uh, I would also say uh, going to property networking events has uh, boosted our credibility. And uh, because sincerely, we do we do do a good job. People are talking about us on uh, social media, and word of mouth is the best recommendation. Well, you can't get better than that. Um, now. Obviously, when landlords are undertaking a certain strategy, they will require furniture such as HMOs, um, uh, holiday lets. It's very important that they choose the right furniture for that particular property type, isn't it? Absolutely, yeah. The, the main thing that we, we work on and, and, and sell our sort of products on is, is actually um, the, the, the product being good and strong. Mm -hmm. um, so we give three-year guarantees on our furniture, which I think we're unique in the market with that. Um, but the main thing is that absolutely it's, it's got to last. Yes, yeah. it's got to look good, but the main thing it's got to last because it's a big investment for the, for the landlord. So mm -hmm. that's uh, something we work hard on. I think it's so important, James, because even such a thing as, you know, a little tip like having a good quality mattress, that's so important because if you don't have that, then, you know, tenants aren't going to get a good night's sleep and they won't stay or they won't enjoy their holiday. Absolutely. I mean, uh, gone are the days where you used to get away with furnishing a, a HMO, for example, with, you know, a budget mattress and, uh, you know, inadequate furniture. Uh, tenants are a lot, lot more discerning now. It, it is competitive out there and... You, it's reaping what you sow. If you put a good quality mattress in, keep your tenants happy, you'll have less void periods and you will reap the benefits at the end of the day. Mm. I'm very impressed by your showroom here and the oh. quality of the, the <laughs> setup you. you've That's got fun. here. I've, I've been going around saying, oh, I want that, I want that for my own home. So that must say something about it. But if we kind of compare furnished versus unfurnished, um, you know, for standard buy to let, some landlords may find that they can achieve a higher rent if they provide a furniture pack. It's important to understand the tenant demographic and what's working in that area, isn't it? Yeah, I think uh, if you don't mind, James is probably better to answer this because he used to be a letting agent as okay. well. So he understands the financials yeah. of it. Yeah, that's uh, that's right, Neil. That's that's where uh, Neil and I. Like, I I was a letting agent and and, and a customer of uh, Fusion Furniture Solutions. So you know, I have got experience. Uh, mm -hmm. Be, being on the on the other side of the uh, the, the service, and um, that's why I decided to work with Neil. Uh, but to answer your question, I mean, in city centres, uh, predominantly, you know, ninety percent of, of the apartments, it's a prerequisite for them to be furnished to market demand. However, when you come into the suburbs and you get a sort of fifty-fifty trend, um, I, I would recommend, as, as I would as an agent, to my clients to although the property may be unfurnished in the current status if it's on the market why don't you offer it furnished at a higher rate mm -hmm. say for example depending on the, uh, the the current value 50 to 150 pounds per month mm -hmm. get the tenant to agree to a minimum 12 month ast which makes it then furnishing it viable mm -hmm. and to give an example on a, on a on a one bedroom apartment Let's be conservative. If you charge fifty pound extra for furniture and they signed a twelve month contract, that's six hundred pounds extra. Okay, the furniture pack will cost you, let's say, a thousand pounds, but a high percentage of it is paid for, and you're eliminating the void period. Mm -hmm. And again, I'm being conservative. The tenant may only stay twelve months, but tenants usually stay for a couple of years, so the furniture will wipe its nose, pay for itself. The only problem, just to play my own devil's advocate. Mm -hmm would be if that tenant did move out and then somebody wanted it unfurnished, mm. which can happen, so the law, is if it's, if it's done you just and it's covered a high percentage, either A, store it, then you've got it to use again on the next project, 
or there's plenty of charities out there that would benefit from some quality used furniture and you, you're doing your bit for the community as well. Quite, quite, quite. I think it's also interesting, um, you know, to consider that if you do have a furniture pack, um, a, the tenant is going to walk in with just their suitcase. I think um, there's a strong possibility that, you know, they may stay longer because they've got a really beautifully furnished apartment that they feel really at home with. Um, you know, there's a lot to be said for considering it in what is a very competitive marketplace. Just to even stand out in photographs can Definitely. bring in a lot more viewings, can't it? Yeah, and, and what we do as well is some of the packs we do, we include pictures and bedding and, you know, make it look like a, a view home or show home as well. Mm -hmm. So it gives them that extra thing. And we even have one where it's one of our packs where it says, just bring your toothbrush, because it literally is like has everything with it so um, it does help do that and the other thing that is is worth doing is is definitely worth dressing your room even if it's not with even if you furnished it say with one of our packs mm. you might want to dress it yourself just to, for marketing purposes because mm. it does look so much better mm. on pictures on spare room or wherever you're marketing to have them dressed mm. um, so yeah it's a definite plus point so here at Fusion, you've got different types of packages for different uh, types of uh, property setups, but also you can, landlords can kind of fine tune what they take because they may already have a wardrobe and a bed or something like that. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, on our website, we have got some set packages where we, that do, that, that do promote value because we do buy, you know, get them in in bulk uh, from our, our UK based factory. But, yeah, we, we understand that some landlords want to be a little bit more hands-on or the property might be a regular shape. It may have eaves, uh, as we have in, in our showroom. And, um, yeah, we, we can help with different furniture. Uh, we, we can actually make a bed any size to fit. Um, we can offer a, a, up, an upgrade version if they want to sort of hit a, hit a boutique-style HMO. Uh, we can offer that with you know, sort of a, you know, designed fronts and MDF tops. Mm -hmm. And essentially that should pay for itself because if you're going to put a higher end furniture pack in, you should be able to increase the rent, say conservatively again, £10 a week. Mm -hmm. If you've got a six bedroom HMO, those numbers will add up over the course of the year. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so although we've, you know, on our website, uh, we don't we don't sort of, you know, plough every available, available item into it. Uh, we, we are here to help and to listen to landlords and, and one of uh, the things I noticed when I started working with Neil was uh, the notice above the door that says never say no to a customer mm -hmm. ask me first and uh, you know that, that that is true you know we always see if we can help in any shape way or form and, and again that's that's what uh, give us the credibility and right. why people talk about us because we do genuinely go the extra mile. Well done, well done. So just to finish then, really, it's a nationwide service. It is. What sort of time frames are we looking at that la landlords want yeah, things Yeah, the moment like now? we're working on Yeah, we do. Uh, <laughs> tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, tomorrow <laughs> sometimes does happen. Um, obviously, if somebody does want tomorrow, we will always do our best. We do carry a lot of stock. Um, so it's more, we, we tend to try and work to seven days. Are purely more for booking in our jobs and on scheduling our obviously our, our team um, but yeah if somebody does want something tomorrow chances are we can we can sort something out for them so uh, that'd be great well it's fantastic to have you guys on board with oh, property you. tribes yeah, we're, we're um, in the interest of transparency we would like to say that um, if you do purchase a furniture pack through uh, Fusion via Property Tribes, we will receive a small commission. It helps uh, this site to remain as a free to use community resource. So we appreciate your support in that regard. And these guys are also going to be on hand to answer any questions that you have about furniture or any issues that you're having because you want to become part of the PT Absolutely. community as well, yeah. don't you? So any questions, even if it's you know not relating to actually buying anything off us, if you've just got any questions regarding furniture that you think we can help with, we're happy yeah. to happy to help. So. Well, brilliant. Looking forward to working with yeah, you. Yeah, likewise. Thanks very much. Thank you.